As the sun reaches its zenith at midday, the world is bathed in a dazzling brilliance, a testament to the power and majesty of our celestial neighbor. But as time passes and the sun begins its slow descent, the once potent light gradually weakens, yielding to the encroaching darkness of night. It's a transition that occurs with almost imperceptible subtlety, yet its effects are profound, plunging the world into an abyss of shadows and obscurity. But why does space, with its vast expanse and myriad celestial bodies, appear to us as such a gloomy entity during the night hours? It's a question that has intrigued and confounded humanity for centuries, prompting countless theories and conjectures in an attempt to unravel the enigma. After all, with thousands upon thousands of cosmic light sources adorning the firmament, shouldn't the night sky be aglow with radiant brightness, illuminating the darkness with celestial splendor? Enter the Olber's Paradox, a conundrum that has perplexed astronomers and philosophers alike since time immemorial. At its heart lies a fundamental question. If the universe is truly infinite, and stars are uniformly distributed throughout its expanse, why does the night sky remain shrouded in darkness? To understand the paradox, we must first consider the nature of our own planet, Earth. Our blue home, spinning gracefully on its axis, takes a full 24 hours to complete a single rotation. During the day, as the sun traverses the sky, its warm rays suffuse the landscape with light and color, casting long shadows that dance across the Earth. But as evening falls and the sun dips below the horizon, we are deprived of our natural source of light, left to gaze upon a sky seemingly bereft of illumination. It was the German astronomer Johann Kepler who first became suspicious of this phenomenon in the early 17th century. Despite the countless stars that adorned the night sky, he saw in its darkness clear evidence that the universe could not be infinite. This revelation sparked a fervent debate among scientists and philosophers, each seeking to unravel the mysteries of the cosmos and unlock the secrets of its enigmatic darkness. Enter Heinrich Wilhelm Olbers, whose insights into the nature of the universe would later become known as the Olbers Paradox. Building upon Kepler's suspicions, Olbers proposed a radical hypothesis, that the universe adheres to a perfect cosmological principle, characterized by homogeneity and isotropy. In simpler terms, this means that the universe appears the same to observers regardless of their vantage point or direction of observation. In such a universe, with stars distributed uniformly throughout its expanse, Every star's light should eventually reach Earth, rendering the night sky as bright as the surface of a star itself. Yet, as we gaze upon the nightly firmament, we find no such brightness. Instead, we are met with a profound darkness, punctuated only by the faint glimmer of distant stars. So why does space, with its countless celestial bodies, appear so dark to us? The answer lies in the very nature of the universe itself, a vast and incomprehensible expanse that continues to defy our understanding. If you're liking the video so far, you should consider subscribing to the channel and help us create better content and reach more explorers out there. Now back to the video. In the pursuit of understanding the darkness of space, Heinrich Wilhelm Olbers embarked on a journey of scientific inquiry that would challenge the very foundations of our understanding of the cosmos. Through meticulous research and observation, Olbers arrived at a groundbreaking conclusion. The gases between stars absorb the emitted light, thereby contributing to the pervasive darkness of space. It was a revelation that sought to reconcile the apparent contradiction between the vastness of the universe and the darkness that envelops it. Yet, as we now know, Olbers' assumption was not without its flaws. If starlight were to shine on the gas, it would heat up eventually reaching temperatures that would cause it to emit light of its own. This phenomenon, known as fluorescence, would result in the gases themselves becoming sources of light, thereby dispelling the darkness that pervades space. But Olbers was not alone in his quest to unlock the secrets of the universe. Many of his contemporaries believed that the Milky Way, our galactic home, was a self-contained entity, surrounded by an infinite void. It wasn't until the early 20th century that this prevailing notion was overturned, with the discovery that the faintly glowing formations in the firmament were not gas clouds, as previously thought, but distant galaxies, each home to billions of stars. 
This revelation shattered the notion of an empty universe, revealing instead a vast and teeming expanse filled with countless galaxies and stars. Yet, despite the abundance of celestial bodies that populate the cosmos, space appears dark to us, especially during the nocturnal hours. The answer lies in the distribution of stars within space, which is far from uniform. Instead, stars tend to cluster together, forming galaxies and large clusters of galaxies. This clustering effect means that, on large scales, the density of stars is relatively low, resulting in vast stretches of darkness between them. Moreover, the sheer scale of the universe adds to the perception of darkness. The average distance between our blue home planet and stars in the universe is staggering, quantified at 10 to the power of 23, or 100 trillion light years. To put this into perspective, a light year is the distance that light travels in a vacuum in one year, covering a mind-boggling distance of almost 6 trillion miles in that time. Given this immense scale, it's no wonder that the light emitted by stars takes billions of years to reach us, if it reaches us at all. Indeed, the problem of cosmic darkness is compounded by the finite age of the universe. Experts agree that the universe was formed approximately 13.8 billion years ago meaning that the portion of the universe we can observe is limited by the finite speed of light. This limited scope means that we can only observe a small fraction of the universe, leaving much of it shrouded in darkness. As we ponder the mysteries of the cosmos and the darkness that pervades it, we may wonder, will terrestrial night be accompanied by a dazzling brightness in the distant future? The answer, it seems, lies in the finite nature of stars themselves. While it's true that the universe may seem dark to our earthly gaze, particularly during the nocturnal hours, stars are not eternal entities. Just as all other celestial bodies in space, stars have a limited lifespan, with their nuclear reactions lasting only for a relatively short time. In reality, the night sky is not as dark as it appears to our eyes. Across all spectral ranges, the Earth is bombarded by a uniform weak radiation, known as background radiation. These rays, with a maximum wavelength of about one millimeter, fall into the microwave range of the electromagnetic spectrum. This background radiation is a remnant of the Big Bang, a pivotal event in the history of the universe that continues to shape our understanding of its origins. Approximately 380,000 years after the birth of the universe, the temperature cooled to around negative 454 degrees Fahrenheit, allowing electrons and protons to form stable hydrogen atoms. This marked a crucial turning point in cosmic history, as the universe became transparent to electromagnetic radiation. The light particles released during this epoch still permeate the cosmos today, manifesting as the cosmic microwave background radiation. As the universe continues to expand, the cosmic background radiation has diminished in intensity, losing much of its original power. Today, it is only a fraction of its former intensity a faint echo of the universe's primordial glow. While the universe was once brightly illuminated by this ancient radiation, its wavelength has shifted over millions of years, moving from the visible spectrum to the microwave range. As a result, we can no longer perceive the cosmic background radiation with our human eyes, despite its continued presence throughout the cosmos. While the night sky may appear dark to us, it is a testament to the finite nature of stars and the greatness of the universe. In this vast expanse of the cosmos, our perception is but a mere glimpse into the intricate tapestry of light and matter that fills the universe. Our human senses, limited as they are, allow us to perceive only a fraction of the existing light spectrum. If we were able to perceive the infrared and microwave ranges, the universe would reveal itself to us in a completely different guise, teeming with unseen wonders and mysteries. Indeed, what we perceive as the observable universe is just a small fraction of the total matter that exists. Baryonic matter, visible to us, constitutes a mere 4.9% of the total, with the majority of the universe consisting of dark energy, 68.3%, and dark matter, 26.8%, according to the most current models. While the existence of these elusive entities has yet to be experimentally proven, Researchers are certain of their profound influence on galactic dynamics and cosmic evolution. Dark energy, in particular, is believed to be responsible for the accelerated expansion of the universe, a phenomenon that defies conventional understanding. 
Meanwhile, dark matter exerts its gravitational influence, shaping the movements of visible matter within galactic structures. Together, these enigmatic forces govern the evolution of the cosmos, guiding the trajectories of stars and galaxies through the vast expanse of space. As the universe continues to expand, the gaps between cosmic structures grow ever wider, scattering the light emitted by stars and leaving vast swathes of darkness in their wake. The distant echoes of the Big Bang, once brightly illuminated, have faded over billions of years, their radiance diminished by the relentless expansion of the cosmos. The darkness of space is not merely an absence of light, but a reflection of the vastness and complexity of the universe itself. From the remnants of the Big Bang to the enigmatic forces of dark energy and dark matter, the cosmos is a realm of boundless wonder and discovery. And though the night sky may appear deep black to our earthly gaze, it is a canvas upon which the story of the universe unfolds, revealing the beauty and majesty of creation in all its splendor. And speaking of the Big Bang Theory, did you know that the James Webb Telescope is threatening it? I dive a little further on the video that is on your screen now. What new mysteries is humanity going to uncover next? Leave it here in the comments and take the opportunity to like the video and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this.